In we go. Ah. Salah versus the tiger. Doesn't seem like a fair fight. Salah won, actually. He was protecting his guru and killed the animal in one blow. It's where the name Hoi Salah comes from. Hoi, meaning strike, in their language. I mean, don't drink it. They've left their climbing gear. They should come in handy. Correction. Our climbing gear. Oh. God, a bit hard on the wrists. Smaller than most men. We are. <laughs> what was that? Hmm? Might have some. Did you find some? I think we are good here. Thing here. You? My area is clear. You check there. I will search here. Sure thing. <clears throat> oh shit! Son of a bitch! They must be close. 
Okay, slightly deep, but I'm good. Oh my. What the hell is this? Okay, let's see what this does. <sighs> that statue moved. Well, let's see how this goes. Well, I'll be going to hell. That's elaborate. <sighs> oh shit. Statue moved again. <sighs> Careful. I don't like the looks of this. Oh, for goodness sake. Three statues with two different symbols now. The star and the priest. They're all voice on our sons, but I like your descriptions better.
Fresh air. Let's make an axe. What the hell? That's not fair. Shiva. Come on, let's get this over and done with. Yep. Whoa! Shit! See? I told you it was dangerous. You hurt. Just my dignity. There we go. Let there be water. Now that's three. You know, you're pretty good at this whole treasure hunting thing. I'm a quick study. Mm. One question, though. I reckon that you could pretty much do anything you want. Why are you so keen to get Shoreline back? Seriously? Mm. My partner tends my own men against me. My lieutenant makes off with the bounty. Nathan and Samuel Drake get off scot-free and you're asking why I want Shoreline back. Yeah. It was on my watch. I lost it on my watch. What the hell is that thing you keep playing with? It's my stress toy. It showed up in the mail a few weeks after we got to Australia. All right, we better get a move on. We don't want Asav to get ahead of us. You know, I've had my fair share of screw-ups. <laughs> you just pick yourself up and move on. I don't like to fail. No one does, love. Ah! <clears throat> Let's head back to the car. <clears throat> Gotta love a shortcut. Glad we don't have to go back the way we came. <clears throat> I would have made you dodge the axes. Time to do it. Right. <laughs> Look, for what it's worth, it's your kick ass reputation that got you this job. Plus, I figured you could use the money. You're not wrong. Honestly, though, it's actually nice working with a woman for a change. <laughs> Too rot. Not many of us out here. I'm just going to take a look around. Yeah, I'll keep an eye out. <laughs> just so I can find you again. Building up my calluses this trip. Shit, can't squeeze through these. 
Hmm. Good thing I packed my thinking cap. you. on the phone. Another token for my collection. Found anything? Found a little something. Naka. This one arms dealer demanded to speak to the man in charge, then tried backing out when I informed him I was running the show. Uh, what did you do? Broke both his legs. Oh my god. You're not kidding. Just trying to level the playing field. Oh, go cross Ross. <laughs> I should put that one on my business card. Can't you just walk away? Just be done with Shoreline? I was born into it. I don't have a choice. Oh, there's always a choice. Coming? Right behind you. What is this place? You got me. Razor, over here. Look. What? What is it? Monkeys. You seem excited. I like monkeys. Looks like there's something in the structure there. Yeah, monkeys. Besides monkeys. Have we here? Let's see. 
Is it just me, or does that look like a map? Looks like our map. Huh. I'll just jot that down. And that makes 11. What about the symbols up there? Symbols? Those figures must be the old Hoysala kings. Eleven, all in all. There's a slot. Just the right size for a token. Let's give it a whirl. They filled up the spots on the map. Yeah. What's happening? We got a prize. A very nice prize indeed. Grey Langus. I like the way their faces are ringed with hair. Whoa! Hey! Oh, that was amazing. God. No hitchhikers. Shoot. Oh, you're no fun. What, you want them shitting all over the seat? Look safe. Smell safe. Let's go. Fraser, need to ask you something. It's important. Go ahead. You and Nathan Drake. Professional relationship? Mostly professional. Oh, God. How? How? Hey, you're not one to talk about questionable choices, mate. A salve? And that other one, the trust fund brat? They weren't a choice, they were means to an end. But Drake, he wasn't so bad. I mean, she just thinks he's so clever. Oh, he's incredibly irritating. Impossibly so, but he's charming in his own way. And it was fun while it lasted. That's all one can ask for, I suppose. But I have to ask, did you two take turns talking or did you just talk over each other? Take a look around. Do what you have to do.
Thank you for your indulgence. 